Get up, get out, get around, and do it, do it! <laughs> hey, what's up, guys? How's everyone doing today? I'm doing well, thank you for asking. Well, today, I'm doing something a little different. I jumped on my trainer, finally. Now, it was a beautiful day out. I could have went for a bike ride. But, I chose to stay indoors, be a little lazy, and, well, that's just a story I'm giving you. So, uh... I'm gonna do this for an hour. I've got some music going, which is copyright friendly. And I got a point of view video going. So, hopefully that'll keep me busy for an hour. Now I'm just gonna ride like I would if I was out riding. I'm not gonna sit here and do some kind of crazy training so whew. I don't even know how to do any of this I want to do a timer but I don't know how there we go one hour there we go Good. I'm just going to pedal like I would normal. I'll check in with you from time to time. Just for fun. Just like we were out on the road. Whew. I'm already feeling it. I just had a big old cheeseburger and some fries that I made. Mwah. If I think about it, I'll put the picture of them in the video. along with my picture of my clogged arteries. Ah, but it was good though. All right. Now this thing has a tension cable on it that I could hook up, but I don't know exactly how to do it where it attaches to the actual trainer so I gotta look at the instructions or go online see if I can find something but it's a little lever that connects to your bars or your stem and it kinda it can give you more tension in that to where you don't have to mess with your gears so much right now I got this in my hardest gear which is good I mean I'm sitting in here on a flat surface so that's the way it needs to be Although, according to that, I'm going up a hill. Whew. It feels like I might be. Alright. I'll catch you in a little bit. Look at this sweat. Good lord. Got it all over the floor. Barely even pedaling. I got 50 minutes left. Going no handed. Woo!
Alright guys, we got 39 and a half minutes left. Yeah. I have to make sure I put a towel down there from now on. I'm going to tell you, it might be actually cooler in the house than it is outside, but there's no airflow really. You know, when you're outside, you at least get some wind going past you. In here, not so much. There's an obscene amount of sweat on my floor. Twenty-nine minutes to go. been way more challenging than riding on the road I think because I've been just non-stop outside of a two-second coast once in a while Yeah, I wear regular clothes when I cycle. Once in a while. Once a month. I might wear some cycling shorts. Underneath my clothes. But I don't usually ride far enough to really matter too much. My rides are usually an hour. Maybe an hour and a half once in a while. Alright, let's do it. Twenty minutes left, guys. Not sure why they won't focus on there. It's annoying. I've been tempted a couple times to jump off and go get a towel and wipe off and then put it on the floor. I can do it. And I've kept it. Woo. In the highest, uh, the hardest, whatever, gear.
Nine minutes, 40 seconds left. I've had no drink with me because I don't usually drink on my rides. Definitely, I could have even worn my gloves. That's how bad I'm sweating. I got sweat rolling all the way down to my hands. Whew. Which is one reason why I wear gloves all the time. One minute, 47 seconds left. Six seconds. I will be wearing my cycling shorts next time. I forgot how uncomfortable this GT seat is. Not GT, <laughs> track. That's so crazy. Nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. <sighs> All right. I'm done. Oh. Holy smokes, guys. Ooh, my butt. Oh. Oh. Ooh. Butt bone. Go home. Ah. Oh. Ooh. Oh. I'll be right back. I gotta go get a towel. Well, guys, not to gross you out, but that's a lot of sweat. Plus, my pants. <laughs> my shirt. Absolutely drenched, guys. Whoo! That was rough. I ain't gonna sit here and lie. That was, that was worse than being on the road. 
and not because of a boring factor necessarily but uh oh here I'm tired Whew. but I kept it in the hardest gear the whole entire time I barely stopped at all you know pedaling at all the whole time and you know when you're out there on the road you got stop signs traffic lights traffic whatever different things and you end up stopping or having to yield a little bit or Plus you got wind out there and everything, so Alright guys, I don't want to gross you out with my body. Uh, anyway, hope you enjoyed this first session on my Cycle Ops trainer. I'm not going to be taking videos of all these rides or anything. That ain't going to be much fun. But maybe once a month or once in a whatever, you know, I might do something like this. So, hope you enjoy it guys. I hope it gives you some inspiration not only to get on the trainer but to get out. Not only that, but to just do something that you enjoy. I don't care what it is. Okay? Get up, get out, get rad, and do it to it. And we'll see you later. Get up, get out, get rad, and do it to it!